Today, I'm gonna be playing some of the most dangerous Roblox games. From games that can hack your PC, to games that I think should be banned. And at the end of each game, we'll be ranking their danger level. And the first game we're gonna be playing is Block Dog Enterprise. So we're now in Block Dog's Enterprise, and this game is supposedly is super dangerous because it's based off a real story. So as you can see, look, a car is pulling in, and that's supposed to be our car. Yeah, look. And you guys see on the top part, I say, this house looks small, and not gonna lie, it does kind of look small, eh? And as you guys can see, down here, we have our key that we're gonna use to open our house. So, uh, uh, let's open our house right here because there's a lock right here. So let's open this boom There we go. Now we can go in I think and there we go. We can go inside the house nice Look at this house. It has like a couch right here It has like a desk over here some tables over here and like a kitchen area right here I think okay, we can open the doors and why is there a crib in this room? Hey, yo wait I don't think I have any children. Uh, that's kind of weird. Don't you think well, let's go into this one Oh, yeah, this room right here is our room nice and low look there's a mirror here yo we look so good all right as you can see i'm tired so i think i should head to sleep but before that let's look at these pictures right here so as you can see there's like a family here it has an x that's kind of weird and there's like a woman right here with like purple hair all right this is kind of weird and then this is the guest kingdom what what does this mean just like the roblox hat all right now we're going to sleep okay now we gotta wake up for the next day and see what happens to the next day what's that weird noise outside okay i didn't hear anything but let's see what's happening outside all right is this we're like in first person now all right we gotta go outside i swear the tv was switched off yesterday wait the tv like turned on or something hey yo look at the tv's turned on yo yo yo, yo. okay this is kind of seeming a little dangerous Okay, let's turn our TV off. Okay. Okay, I think I can go to sleep now. Alright, let's head, let's head to our room. And then nothing should be bothering us anymore. Alright, let's close my door behind me. And uh, let's go to sleep. Because that was actually kind of weird, eh? Alright, now it's day two. So let's see what happens in day two. As you see, there's a hot dog stand outside. Hey, yo, we should go get some hot dogs. Let's go let's get some glizzies. You know what I'm saying? Alright, let's open these doors. Yo, wait, where's the hot dog, man? Bro, there's such a big line, bro. Oh, hell no. I think I gotta, I gotta go in line. All right, let's go in line and let's see if he gives us a hot dog. All right, let's talk to the dude and let's tell him we want a hot dog. So let's tell him we want one hot dog. Please give me the hot dog, bro. Yes, sir. We got a hot dog. Oh, my God. We can start munching on the glizzy. Yes, sir. All right, I think now I should check my mailbox as it says up there. So let's go to the mailbox and let's check what's inside our mailbox. All right, let's open it and let's get whatever is inside. All right, the Bloxy Times. House burned down. Death of a mother and a baby wait wait a minute do you guys remember this lady she was in my room hey yo does this house not kind of look like mine the lady and the baby burnt inside the house okay that's kind of weird so I, I i'm a little tired now so I, I think i should go to sleep all right let's go back to sleep and uh let's forget whatever we saw on the news so uh let's go back to sleep now wait wait the tv's on again hey yo why is it on two days like in a row oh uh, hell no nah, bro why is the tv on bro let's open this door right here Let's go to the let's go to our room. Why is it gonna why is it gonna be turned on again? Alright, let's go here. Uh let's turn this off, bro. I don't want that like annoying me. Is there a baby crying? Yo, I don't have any babies. This story is supposed to be based on a real story, bro. What? I can't even imagine someone living this. So uh let's open this door and let's see if there's any baby. There's no baby. Why, why did the crib fell, bro? It fell to the ground. It wasn't like this when I came in. I think I should fix it. Okay, uh let's try and like uh, put it up there we go we put it up uh i, I think it's time to go to sleep now all right I, I think i should just forget about that and let's go back to sleep again and i don't know if you can hear it but the hog dog stand guy is back outside so i think we should go get another hog dog because it's like the only pleasant thing that happens in this neighborhood so let's open this right here okay now he has no line oh wait he does have a line i just didn't see it so let's get back in line and let's get our glizzy gobbler all right there we go we got our glizzy yes sir let's gobble this up gum, 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 gum. there we go all right, and I think we should check the mailbox again because uh, let's see if there's any weird news like there was yesterday. So let's open this mailbox right here and uh, let's check. Uh, what the hell? What is that, bro? The, the, I, if you turn it around, I think you should be able to read it, but I can't even read that. What is this, man? Whoa, that was super weird. And yo, it's like night. It's so dark now. Well, let's go to sleep and let's try and forget about that. All right, it's day four. And I don't know if you guys can hear it, but the... The, the hot dog stand well like music is all weird now and well, let's go outside and uh let's let's uh, go get our hot dog again because uh, i think that's what we have to do all right i think there's no one here but the hot dog man and what happened to the clientele what happened to his face he has no face and the hot dog worker look at his face bro that is so weird hell nah but, well let's get our hot dog and uh let's see what happens man uh let's try and talk to him uh, I'm, I'm good man just give me the usual one hot dog please 
Okay, he gave me the hog dog. I hope this hog dog's not poisoned or something. L let's try and gobble it up again. Okay, let's eat this hog dog. Okay, I took damage. Yo, what happened to my skin? All right, it's day five and everything is dark now. Bro, did my house burn down? Why does my house look like it burned down? Bro, I think my house just burned down. Everything's gone. What? Where's the hog dog stand guy? Is he even here? Oh my god, what is that? And with that crazy ending, I think this game deserves to get a 7 out of 10 on the dangerous level. Now, the next game that we're gonna be playing is Do Not Play Scariest Game Ever. Alright, we're now in the scariest game in Roblox, and that's legit what it's called. And this game is supposed to be dangerous because it's supposed to be based on what happens in Area 51. And as you can see, down here, I have multiple stuff. I have a torch, I have a glow stick, and then I have a flare, and then I also have some health. If you can see, my health is like a bloxy cola, level. that's actually so cool. And I also have my flashlight I can use and to see the monsters so supposedly down here in this hole are all the monsters that we're going to be encountering today and all these monsters are said that they are real and these monsters can actually hack your pc so this is why this game is super dangerous so let's go through the stair and let's find out if this game is actually super dangerous so we don't want, want to fall we do not want to die there we go we have made it downstairs and you can see it's super dark i don't know if you guys can see this but i can barely even see this so let's grab our flashlight there we go now we can actually look really well and i don't know if you guys heard that but there was like a monster right there uh so let's Let's see if we can open the door uh let's uh let's open the door oh my god what is that bro he bro he just flashbanged me oh i got tasered what and yo look at this i found a gun yo nice and now we can go inside here without being that worried that we will find a monster as you can see it's super dark let's grab our flashlight obviously right here let's turn this on okay we do not want to die we do not want to find any monsters but good thing we have a weapon right here that we can use to kill all the monsters what is that Bro, yo, this game actually seems real dangerous. Okay, is that a player? Okay, that's a player, actually. Okay, there's like no monsters. Yo, look at this. Oh my god, there's scientists who are dead here. Whoa, whoa, if the Area 51 is actually like this, this might be one of the dangerous places in the earth, bro. But good thing no one has gone in there, bro. I don't know if you guys remember, but in 2019, everybody wanted to block Area 51, but that didn't even happen. Yo, and look up here. I think I can run with this button. Oh, yes, I can run. There we go. We can actually go so much faster now. If in case if we find any monster yo look at there's a health pack right here we can grab this health pack nice okay now we can use that if we uh if we die or anything okay let's go through this vent right here all right let's drop down here all right we haven't found any monster yet okay that's pretty good because it is said that all these monsters also can hack your pc oh my god if they kill you whoa, 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 whoa. get away from me get away from me oh my god what is that is that the monster bro oh he just stopped me Bro, I just died. We can't out kill that monster. I legit tried to kill it with the, with the machine gun. You guys saw that. What? Well, I think that's enough for this dangerous game. Let's go play our next dangerous game now. And with that undefeatable boss, I think this game deserves an 8.5 out of 10 on the dangerous level. And for the last game, we're going to be playing Blood Overhaul. All right, we are now in Blood Overhaul. And as you can see, this game is still in development, but this game is super graphic. So I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to censor some of these parts of the videos because this game is actually so graphic that you guys are not going to be able to see it and we have two versions we can play without blood or with blood like i said this game is super gruesome so i'm gonna play without blood because i do not want you guys to see these crazy games and as you can see we are now in the lobby of blood overhaul so what we have to do is we gotta come over here and we have to grab some weapons but you might be wondering why do we need weapons well you guys are gonna be seeing in a minute so let's just grab all these weapons as you can see over here we have three modes we have sandbox mode zombie mode or scenario mode and what we're gonna do is that we're gonna go into scenario mode and we're gonna choose uh this map right here it's called the town so let's go into the town map you're now in a town right here so now i'm gonna show you guys why this game sh is super dangerous and why i think it should actually be banned so you can see we have jeff right here and if i shoot him <gasps> boom he loses his arms bro look at it he loses his arms and his legs if i shoot him oh my god and i'm gonna have to censor some of these parts because it's actually so gruesome you guys are not gonna be able to see so this is basically what this game is we can shoot people and we can see like the different interactions between them so let's shoot him with this gun right here boom 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 boom, boom. oh he fell down oh no man i think i'm gonna have to censor that also right here look at this call is he's called a wealthy person let's see if we kill him if we get some money i'm sorry wealthy person oh my god look at his body he lost his whole body. It's just, bro, he lost his arms, his legs, and his head. And the phone's just glitched there. Yo, and look at that. There's a science lab over there. Let's see if we can do anything inside that science lab. Like, uh, get some, like, sign potions or something. Explode everything up. I don't know what this game has in store, but let's go check it out. Okay, uh, you guys can see there's a staff-only spot. I'm going in because I don't care. Look at this weapon. Yo, this is a scientist. Take this, scientist. Bro. Oh, 
Bro, he went back. Oh, hell nah, man. Yo, look at this room, bro. This is like the SCP logo. I don't know if you guys ever seen the SCP logo. Oh, Lord, look at this. There's another player here. I think we're supposed to go through this spot and let's see what happens. Bro, look at all these scientists. They're all dead. They're infected scientists, bro. Yo, yo, die, die. Get out of here. Get out of here. All these infected scientists, bro. Oh, my God. Yo, and look at this arrow up here. Wait, can we go through here? Hey, yo, we're in like in a passageway. What is this? There's a special weapon here. The fire gun. Wait, so let's take this gun and let's see what we can do with it. Oh my god, look at the effect of the gun. Bro, the sound effects are also so cool. Hey, yo, hey, yo, wait. Can we kill, can we like burn people with this gun? Yo, this is actually so dope. Look at this. All right, let's burn some people up. Let's burn this player up. Wait, can I burn this player up? I, I don't think I can burn him up. But let's go try and burn some like civilians in here. Yo, look at how many people are in here. I'm sorry, guys, but I'm gonna burn you up. Boom, burn, burn, burn. Yes, sir, but why does that kind of look like Walter White? No, I killed Walter White! But he, but he has no beard. What? And that was Blood Overhaul. And I think this was the most dangerous game we played today. So I'm gonna give that a 10 out of 10 on the dangerous level. And well, that's the end of the video. Comment down which dangerous game was your favorite. Remember to like and subscribe. And also comment what Roblox games you want me to play next.